Kennedy had just taken the presidency. That's the kind of time gap we're talking about here. I don't recall what that car sold for new Bob, but I seem to think because my dad, I have a brochure that my dad got from the dealer and wrote all the numbers down on. He was considering it, and I believe it was somewhere in the neighborhood of $4,000 brand new. A lot of money back then. Well, still, it was a lot of car back then. That's true. <laughs> and I bet you wish you could have talked him into it, huh, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> I was 10 at the time, but yes, I sure would have tried. Here comes a customized GOAT, a 67 Pontiac GTO two-door hardtop. There's a ton of money under the hood. Uh, Jim and Glaze is probably the nation's foremost expert on Weber carburetors, and he did these. These are the side draft Webers uh, feeding through an interesting manifold here, and the side drafts used for hood clearance, and maybe they were a little more widely available than the down drafts that you used to see on the Cobras uh, back at the time. Edelbrock heads. So nothing very original here. And when you get to the interior, it's even less original. The, uh, let's see, the dash is original. The grab handle above the glove box and the glove box door is original. That's about it. Everything else has been redone in a lot of suede or Alcantara. Four bucket seats and a center console in the rear. Amps and speakers and things in the trunk. Big foos wheels, front and rear. So a very nice custom. Nowhere near an original car, but one that was built to taste to the owner, and he's ready to pass it on to the next one. And if the situation were otherwise, I might be just the guy. If this car was restored to original, I'd be thinking $70,000, $75,000, so we're right there. And that's, that's probably the money. Tony Stewart just put a bid in. Okay, I wonder if the uh, bidder assistant has said to this guy, okay, you're bidding against Tony Stewart for this car. And he really wants it. He could just sit there with his paddle in the air as long as he wants to. Boy, what a great intake system. Really. Really road racy, expensive, exotic <laughs> stuff. That is showing off. Sitting, on the, sitting on the top of that V8. Whoa. Smoke is the lead bidder right now. Whoops. I think. I may be wrong about that. We're up to 100 grand. You can be sure Tony Stewart is not just ripping off bids here. He does his homework. He knows what he wants and he knows what he wants to pay for it. Tony, don't quit now. 125. Two time. 120. Did he get it? Yes, he did. He did. Our 48th car to sell for $100,000 or more today. That autograph's not free, Tony. That one costs you 120 grand plus commission. I get a little shiver knowing that Tony and I seem to have the same taste in custom GTOs. 53 total, 100,000 or higher for the auction. Rick DeBrule. Over here in the showcase.